Hey guys, it's Chloe, and today I'm here with a brand new video. Today we are doing the summer reading tag. Um, summer here in Florida is almost over, like summer vacation wise, but summer the weather, um, we have uh, 365. So there are eight questions, so let's go ahead and get started. Question number one, what three books do you want to read this summer? From Twinkle with Love by Sanja Menon, Isla and the Happily Ever After by Stephanie Perkins, and Eliza and Her Monsters by Francesca Zappia. Question number two, which character most embodies the traits of summer? I'm gonna go with Andy from The Unexpected Everything by Morgan Matson. It has been a hot second since I have read this book, but I just remember it's set in summer. So I feel like everything the character does is very summerish, like getting a summer job and stuff and stuff like that. Does that make sense? And I'm also gonna go with Taylor from Second Chance Summer, also by Morgan Matson, because I feel like she definitely embodies summer of going to a beach town and getting a summer job. And I don't know if I'm actually answering this question right, but I'm just gonna roll with it. Question number three, what book do you most associate with the physicality of summer? We're gonna go back to Second Chance Summer because this book is actually set in a beach town um and at a beach at a beach house so i feel like this is pretty good for this answer question number four what kind of books do you like to read on holiday any books that hold memories to certain places um whenever i go on vacation i tend to bring the book that i'm just currently reading before i go on vacation i don't really have any special thoughts about it um normally when i go on vacation i don't tend to read a lot i, I try to and i just it doesn't happen um, but when I go to Universal, if I'm waiting in long lines, I normally have an ebook and I tend to get good reading done there. Question number five, if you could go on holiday with any author, who would you go with and where? What would you want to know? I have a couple of answers for this. One, the main one probably being JK Rowling. I think everybody's answer is gonna be JK Rowling because you just, she, she created the Harry Potter universe and that is such a huge, huge, iconic, thing now. Another one would be Marissa Meyer um, because she's just one of my favorite authors and I love her. And a third one would be Kira Cass. Actually right now I think Kira Cass is on vacation right now because she keeps posting on Instagram and she's in Hawaii. And I think that's pretty awesome. Question number six. What's your book of the year so far? I feel like my book of the year is always something that I like recently finished that I love. I recently finished My Playing Jane. This was the last book that I finished and it was so good. And I really, really liked this. Also really enjoyed The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue by Mackenzie Lee. This was the first book I finished this year. Those are just two of the books I loved. Another one that I don't own is Royals by Rachel Hawkins. That one was really good as well. So number seven, how did you spend your summer holidays as a child? Well, when I was like an actual child, I went to daycare at the place that I currently work. Um, so I was always there over the summer. After that, I don't really remember that as much, like what I did during the summer after. I think I just stayed home a lot. Um, yeah, pretty, pretty eventful. Question number eight, what are your plans this summer? Well, like I said, summer holiday right now is o almost over. Um, we have a couple more weeks left of summer before public school goes back into uh, session and then like two weeks after that college goes back into session so i've got like a month left um basically my summer plans my summer so far has been working everybody's schedule who's on vacation um and going to school and i only have one assignment left for school so that's fantastic and then um my plans for the rest of the summer like the month that i have left is I have two concerts that I'm going to. I'm going to the Panic of the Disco concert next week, and I'm going to the Taylor Swift concert the week after that. Um, and then, I don't know, I'm just living my life. So guys, that is all I have for this video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, if you'd like to check out my vlog channel lessons, it's linked in the description below. And if you'd like to see here, please go ahead and click subscribe. I post new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. So click subscribe so you can be updated for when I post those. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.